the blazing wood landed on the timber deck. A moment later, flames slipped up in the prow of the longship. Hannah, Jan, and I tossed our blazing torches onto the deck. Within seconds, the ship was alight from stem to stern. Donner's fury knew no limits. He hurled orders to his men. They jumped onto the burning ship using their helmets to strip water from the tunnel onto the flames. Fritjof jumped onto the tunnel using his gigantic hands to wash water over the long ship. But the fire had too firm a hold. Flames raced up a majestic sail. Soon it was blazing from top to bottom. Then the mass caught fire. It collapsed, adding more flames to the inferno below. The deck was going up in monstrous sheets of flame. Even Fitzgerald couldn't save the ship. Slowly, meter by meter, the great long ship began to sink. The warriors screamed as they fought to save the ship. They were still screaming when the blazing ship vanished beneath the murky waters of the tunnel. The flames disappeared. The writings were gone.